don't let me drown. What's going on, you lot? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, hello, my name is Lydia, and I'm going to have videos here on YouTube. Today, I'm doing a showing you what is inside my distraction box, as well as how I put it together. It's all pre recorded, so I get to attempt to do a voiceover. So, as you'll notice, what I put in the box is very, very suited to me as a person. Like, I put hair dye in, I put perfumes in, I put self-help books in, I put notebooks in, I put drawing in, I put things in that make me feel happy and things I'm safe using. I don't put anything in my box that could be used as a weapon. I have a lot of face masks too. Lots of face masks. The importance of this box to me is so much more than people realise. I made this box initially to prevent me from self-harming and it really does help because it's a physical distraction box. I do also have food in mine. Food's always a healer. We all love food. Food is great. Um, it's something that I would recommend. It's something that I would recommend other people do. So what a distraction box is, is a box of things you put into a box that you can use when you're reaching low moods or you feel you're starting to go off the tracks of it. It's a distraction box to distract from what's going on. See, it's not a cure. My mental health team actually advised me to make this box and I did it while I was in hospital. And I've just added to it more and more. Like today, I bought a fiddle, new fiddle cube that I'm going to be putting into it and I'm super excited about it. I would recommend to you to have one and I am going to, when I reach like 5k, I'm doing a giveaway of a distraction box. I'm going to go out shopping and spend lots of money but that's to come in the future, that's not right now. We're gonna be doing a giveaway and I'm looking forward to doing that. Though if you wanna send me mail and get mail off me, there's an address that is on my second Twitter account. It's not on my public account for very obvious reasons once you see why. If you wanna follow my Twitter, it's right here. Um, my private Twitter is here. Uh, I have the two accounts because some people don't want to see the triggering stuff and that's what that's the second profile's for. But if you want to send mail, the address is also on there. So you can go get that, then you can sort of follow if you're not into the intense steps of my mind. And that being said, I think that's all I've got for you guys today in this video. I hope you enjoyed it and gave you some ideas for your box. If you have a distraction box or are going to be making one, please send me a photo of what you're doing. Like, I'm really interested. What are your thoughts on my box? Do you think it's a good distraction box for me? Am I too childish with what I put in? Let me know in the comments down below and I'll catch you guys tomorrow with a new video. Peace.